Hey everybody, it's Savage Sage, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Breath of Fire 2. I'm still sick. It's still the same recording session, so ahead of time, I apologize for my nastiness. But anyways, let's keep going around here, because we have the evil... Here's a couple new... No, these aren't new. These are basilisks. But anyways, we are going after the evil Shupke, who is apparently going to use the princess to try to find some... Use some weapon here in High Fort. I just wanted the freaking flute. Um, I just want to get the flute, be able to talk to the people in Tumlin. But uh, apparently, now we're all caught up in Sten's past drama. Now, that being said, it sounds like in the past, Sten was a little bit of a little bitch. Yeah, he ran from the war, abandoned the princess, but. Now Sten is kind of back and seeking redemption, so maybe he can make up for it somehow, but the Shupke is causing problems. <laughs> I don't know why I said that like that. Oof! Let's see if we can get him in a sea sludge. You guys know what these are, they're the best. Let's see if we can spore him too, might as well. And we have the lead off attack, so that's nice. Nice, nice, we're like, I want that experience, give it to me. This, that will overlevel all of these people. Oh, nice! And Spar did get the. Oh no! I was so gypped. Fine, fine. We won't get the sea sledge. It's not like Spar set it up perfectly. Put the pollens to sleep. <laughs> That's so sad. Anyways, I don't know why I chose the long way either, but we definitely just took the long way. Here's another sea sledge. Okay, redemption, redemption. Let's do the same. <laughs> Fuck those sea sledges. They're just teasing me. Don't even show up then. Like, <laughs> why? Ooh, here's a new enemy. Soul flicker. It, that's actually a really creepy concept, to be honest with you. But, uh, they're not too hard. All the enemies here are, like, these newer ones. The Deathbringers and the Soul Flickers and such. Um, they actually give some good experience, so if you felt like grinding here, you could. I definitely, after I beat Trubo the first time, on my first playthrough, I definitely, um, just sat here and grinded Sten for a little bit, because I'm like, alright, shit, you have to use everybody, okay. Understood. <laughs> and so I had to catch up on him, some grinding, because I never ever used him, but. Which is silly, because Sten is a good, well, he's, he's a party member. And do be careful with those pharaohs. They do have rotten breath, so they can turn you into a zom zom if you're not careful. The encounter rate in here is ridiculous, but the levels are worth it. And it's not like these battles are hard either. I mean, it'd be cool if Spar did something during those battles, but it's fine. He'll be super useful with bosses and stuff, and actually he gets better later. Right now in this part of the game, he is kind of useless. Oh my gosh. I forgot that this was here. Well, that's fine. Can't hurt to heal everybody twice. Yay! And that's like the first one we've seen since the original cave with Bo. Like, they like acted like that was going to be a normal thing. A moon mask. Oh my gosh. What is that? I bet it's better for Cat, probably. No. Moon mask. You can do the moon mask. Of course, it's Sten's dungeon. Better defense? Sure. Let's do it. Why the heck not? Let's just make it Sten a badass. Let's just do it. Inspar has so much HP, too. Like, and I don't unnecessarily, like... I don't know. I'm, I'm, I've always been confused. <sighs> Why? I've always been a little confused on that, because it's like, okay, Spar, but why? Like, you're not a tank, I don't, what are you doing? It's definitely nice, like, oh my gosh. They're freaking poisoned, and, and, I don't think I have any way to fix it. <sighs> why? I'm going to run back to that little well and meet you right back here. Alright, and here I am again. First off, fuck those enemies for poisoning me. 
fuck the enemies for poisoning me, and fuck Spar for not being able to cure poison. Like, what? Hey, wait a minute. I want to go up. I feel like this little dungeon here is not that hard of a dungeon, but at the same time... Oh, a sea sludge. At the same time, this confuses the fuck out of me. Like, why sea sludge? Oh my god. I hate sea sludges. I'm done with them. <laughs> I officially... I officially give up on the sea sludges. Fuck them. <laughs> Whatever. Wow! I just killed some of the pharaohs and they dropped a skull BR. Let's check that out. Skull BR. It has strange powers? Question mark. Let's just put it on Ryu. Why the fuck not? Let's see what it does. And then that means we have an extra guts BT for somebody. Probably... Probably cat. Let's give her twice the guts. Let's check out the two fires. Ryu has four freaking fires. Ryu has the most. Whatever. Whatever. Alright, let's get the heck through here. This place is like, I always think that it's not that hard of a dungeon, but then I always get lost every time. What do you got to say to me? Emergency exit. Nope. Not going to do that. What about over here? Oh, you're that. Oh my. That's rude as shit. Alright. Well, I'll meet you back over in the teleporting room. Fuck my life. And I'm back here. That was trash, but let's go through this one. Oh my gosh, Trubo. What the hell? You can't nap right here? Oh, you got your ass kicked. Okay, okay. By a door? You got your ass kicked by a door? Trubo. You are... Oh my god, Sten? What the... What the fuck? That was savage as fuck. Whatever, we'll take out the door. Uh, my password is... Fuck you, bitch! You're gonna die! And this is Portal! Except he's not a portal, he's a door. But yeah. Portal is a boss, kind of. Not hard, though. So let's... First, let's start defensing up people. Or do I want to... Yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. Let's get in a re right away. Post haste. Nice special stun. Dang. Look at that damage. Oof, Typhoon. So the thing is, is you need to definitely be healing here a lot. Because Typhoon hurts. And Nina does have Typhoon now. So if you're using Nina, that's a great, amazing spell for random battles. Way better than Spar, but find it's whatever so let's do this like this let's heal ourselves up because we need it oh my gosh you don't even the thing about spy right now is no spells he has no spells like once he levels up more he does get better i promise but right now it's like really you know nothing ouchies Ooh, sten is getting close but here comes spar with the cure one Whoa. Nice. And so yeah, we just keep whacking away at this portal. We'll just have Sten do that, yeah. And then she can shh, agility up Ryu. Does agility up work? I don't know. We'll find out. We will stink and find out. Oh, he's defensing anyway, that's fine. Does this work? Do you feel faster, Ryu? He doesn't know. He says, I'm not sure. But I know for a fact defense up works. So let's use that on Sten now. Come on, portal. Freaking die. Um, you could use a dragon on this one if you wanted. I like to save the dragon because there's... I mean, we're going to be fighting something else pretty soon here. So you could either use your dragon and then go back to that fountain and then come all the way back here. But um, I'm literally not doing that again because I already did it once on accident. So, that won't be happening this time. Let's see if defense down will work on the portal. Are you almost dead, sir? You're not a hard boss. You don't do much. Typhoon does kind of suck, but if you're prepared for it, you're fine. But this, his physical attacks are like, what are you doing? 
Why are you even trying? Failure! Well, that's unfortunate. Let's just have them hit, and let's just have Spar use the item, because he's literally worthless otherwise right now. How unfortunate. Yay, the portal is done. We get a shit ton of experience for that. Everybody's leveling up, except for Spar, apparently. And the force field has been cancelled. Goodbye, door. Get out my way. Too bad we crippled Trubo. Like, oh, he's fine. I'm still not sure why Sten just punched him in the face like that, but it's okay. The control room. Okay. Well, then, destroy the control room, Trubo. Oh, you want me to do it, like I do everything else around here. Okay. Whatever, Trubo. Um, is this it? No, I guess it's up ahead. That's right, these monsters have no boundaries. They'll e attack you even here. Even here. So let's see if we can go get the Shoop K and stop her from using the princess for her evil dark whatever the hell she is doing with the princess. Okay, I'm scared as hell to do this because I keep getting screwed over, but... Oh... Do not take this portal. It takes you back to where uh, Shuke drops Sten in the hole. Alright, let's go up these stairs. Let's just do it. Let's go. And let's go up these ones. Why not? Oh, because the other ones look like they have chests. <laughs> That's why not. Let's go. We want to get some treasure. Nice. A collar. And another Tolan Nito. We'll use those once we go back to... Um, township it has strange powers question mark i'll use that a collar that sounds like it should go on bow not to be rude but he's a, he's a dog so we'll do that for him i'm not sure what it does to be honest oh shoop cake what get the princess out of there what the heck this machine takes the strength of the human heart oh my gosh so she's like sucking the life out of the princess. I order you to kill me. Jesus Christ. It's not very Elforin. That's the princess's name, I guess. I mean, it's not ladylike, but the life is getting sucked out of her. Yeah, we did appear. I mean, your dungeon is not that good at keeping monkeys in. Oh my gosh, her feeling of sadness will be changed into a very strong energy. You are disgusting. So she's trying to like use her emotions and suck the life out of her. No shock, Shubke's a freaking demon. Yep, she's a demon. So yeah, that's why I wanted to save the dragon powers. Let's use Thunder Dragon this time. Just because uh, you have to fight Shupke here. And Shupke can be a hard boss. She has lots of magic. You want to stay on top of your healing for sure. Um, let's go ahead and do defense up on Cat. I feel like Cat is the most glass cannon person we have right now. Yeah, Shupke counterattacks all the time. So that's something that you need to... Well, not like all the time, but pretty often. So you need to keep that in mind. Because even though she does use a lot of... Healing, I mean, a lot of um, spells. Jesus, I can't even think. Even though she uses a lot of spells and magic attacks, uh, those counterattacks can hurt. Like, look what she just did to Cat. Now, that's why we're going to be using Spar for the defense up here. That's my plan. Let's actually have you heal Cat this round. Because if she gets counterattacked again, it'll hurt. Ouchies, Mooey, ouchies. Curse. Don't curse us. That's silly. You're a silly willy, Shupke. I really like Shupke's design a lot, even though it's kind of disgusting because that looks like like flesh or something. I'm not sure. Now, Shupke does have a lot of defense, but I'm not sure if I can lower her defense or not. I'm assuming not because most bosses you just can't. They, no. Drain, I believe that's the HP version. Spar does have that, but it's just not... Those draining spells don't really work that well in this game. Actually, I'm never, not really a fan of those in any game, to be honest. Yeah, I didn't think we could lower her defense. It was worth a shot, though. Um, one thing you could do, which I'm maybe half considering, is use 
spar to do like W fruits on Ryu to try to use his dragon again. Uh, because Shuke, I mean, is not the. She's kind of going easy on us right now, but she has some tough spells. And I'm not really down with a lot of them. So it's a. It's a viable option, anyways, is what I'm trying to say, to use the dragons twice. If you really wanted to, you could use spar for that function, but I'm not going to do that, to be honest with you. So let's get defense up on Ryu, finally, and then just start healing. Because, uh, so far, she's going really easy on us. We will see, though. That drain is worthless. Worthless drain! We're getting really lucky so far, actually. Not that Shuke is, like, crazy hard, but, I mean, we made that look pretty friggin' easy there. And some levels. Spar gets Cure 2, finally. A little late, but it's fine. Oh! And then she just, like, jumps into the thing herself. She's a kamikaze. A flying fortress, huh? That's the secret of High Fort. Huh. By using the human energy. She has a barrier around her. Well, I guess she's going to sacrifice her life to turn this place into a flying thing. I said I would stop it, but I'm not very good with technical stuff. Well, you're a monkey, so... I mean, nobody's expecting you to... Great plan. Yep. Break it. Destroy it. Oh, yep. That'll work for sure. Absolutely. Let's destroy it. That's fine. I mean, yes. Uh, Trubo? Oh, shit. Trubo, what are you gonna do? <laughs> Please stop. Huh. Oh, that's Trubo. Backwards? Explode? Oh, shit. Well, that's what you get, Shuke. Bye. But yeah, we're pretty screwed. We gotta get the hell out of here. Let's go. Run! Yeah, that's right. This is the most epic scene ever. Ding! We barely survived that. This place is going down. We just wanted the flute! And here we are destroying yet another home. Oh my gosh, 10 nice moves. Nice moves. He is a monkey, but still. Good job. Oh my gosh, you people and your manual fucking elevators. I can't believe this. Sten will do the elevator. I mean, we'll protect her, Sten, but are you going to die here or what? Until we meet again. Oh, Stan, you finally got kissed by somebody. And you don't even care. Right Look at that arm go, Jesus. Wow. Elforin. Poor Stan. And he died. Just kidding. Stan's alive. Spoiler alert. Um, yeah, he's dead. Yeah, that's true. I'm sure he's fine this time as well. And it's nice to see that only the top half of the castle blew up. And that you still have your throne room. That's kind of cool. So, can we just have Trubo instead since you guys killed Sten? Yes, that's all we wanted was the flute. Thanks. Sorry we had to kill your general and blow up the top half of your city to do it. But, uh, thanks for the flute. What do you mean? You you don't have a request. We just saved your life. You don't get to request shit. Oh, the monkey? Yeah, Sten. Tell him what. Take care of yourself and don't overdo it. And I hope that someday... Sure, we'll watch over the monkey. But he's dead, so... Thanks, Drubo. Since we can't leave here... You guys have made it really inconvenient for visitors, because unless you're a monkey, you can't grab across those poles. Like, the hell is that? 
Oh, you're still in love with her? You think you two would have hooked up while Sten was quote unquote dead? What a drag. I don't see how. He's kind he was really creepy when we first met him. I mean we're friends with him now. I clearly am a, I like Sten now, but I wouldn't necessarily call him a ladies man. He was kind of more disgusting and Cat almost killed him, so I'm not really sure what Truba's referring to there, but it's fine. Yeah, Truba, let's get out of here. Oh shit. There's Sten, he's still alive. Well, duh. He's like a cockroach. He doesn't die. I failed to die again. Jesus, Sten. How dark. No, not everybody, Sten. You guys lived. I'm not reading any of those names. <laughs> like just sharpened knives. What a compliment, question mark. Bro, Sten won't die. He's a cockroach. Yeah, Trubo is a good guy, I guess. What the fuck? He just jumps off. He's like, all right, bye. See ya. I mean, it's fine, Sten. Yeah, we noticed that you're an ex-soldier. Well, let's get the hell out of here then. So yeah, that's kind of heartwarming. So in the next episode, we will take this flute over to Tunlin so we can finally talk to them. And then hopefully we can get the therapy pillow from them to go inside the tree's mind. Hopefully that's confusing enough for you. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please consider subscribing. It, the support really means a lot, and I will see you guys in the next one.